Hey, okay, you know, I hear these um, life coaches, these gurus, and, and everybody in my industry say, all you have to do is think positively and it'll all work out for you. Well, you know what? That's nonsense. I got to be honest with you, that's nonsense. All right. If you're not a positive thinker, or if you if you just you know don't have no hope, you can't become a positive thinker. And it's not about positive thinking. That's the whole thing here. It's about being optimistic. You can be optimistic even though you're a pessimist. We can switch it. We can move you towards the optimistic side. What you have to do is you have to always know that there's a ray of hope. There's always something on the other side for you. There's always something, and I don't mean the other side, I mean the other side of where you're at now. I'm sorry to scare you. <laughs> um, there's always something you can work towards if you stay optimistic, if you know that someday something's going to work out for me and it'll be good. So uh, you just have to stay, you know, optimistic. And with the optimism, the positiveness will come. Okay? But that's what you have to be to get to the positive. Because if you're a positive thinker and it doesn't happen, um, you're going to get depressed. So don't, don't do that. Don't, don't fall into that trap. That's a trap. It's optimism that's important. You can call that positive in a sense. Yeah, it is. But it's a little different. You just have to be optimistic that well, I'm in a bad place or this isn't going on or that's not right. But I know down the road something's going to happen and I will be there. And by staying optimistic, it will give you incentive to work towards what you need to work towards. All right. Listen, I hope that made sense to you. I hope all this makes sense to you. you know, I'm just putting out there what I'm hearing, guys. I'll talk to you soon. And always be optimistic and always stay hopeful, never hopeless. Take care.